so cool. Hi guys, I just checked off a childhood ba ba bucket list today. And I'm here at Disneyland Hong Kong. Yeah. Why I like Hong Kong? First is the ease of travel. Public transport is remarkably efficient, which makes it very family friendly. Imagine, we're walking with a big baby bag, a stroller, a carrier, and a hyper toddler. Attractions like Disneyland and Ocean Park can be easily accessed via MTR. We went to the said attractions via just their train system. Deep in tips! Purchase an octopus card worth 200 HKD or 300 HKD then just refund the excess at the airport before you leave Hong Kong. You can use octopus cards to pay for MTR, bus, or even food in case you're running out of cash. Second is the attractions. the attractions here like Disneyland, Ocean Park, Victoria Peak, Symphony of Lights, Museums, Wax Museums, Avenue of Stars, and much more. Today, I will talk about two of my favorite family-friendly attractions in Hong Kong. Hong Kong Disneyland. Hong Kong Disneyland is the happiest place in Hong Kong. It is pretty much like the Disneyland but scaled down and way smaller than that of in America. It is open from 10.30 a.m. to 8.15 p.m. every day. One of the must-see in this attraction is the fireworks, but then it rained so hard when we went there. That's why the fireworks show and the parade got cancelled. My favorite here is the Iron Man ride. You gotta try that. Ocean Park Ocean Park is the theme park that has various attractions and rides, including roller coasters, animal exhibits with different themes such as giant panda habitat, rainforest and polar displays, as well as an aquarium featuring the world's largest aquarium dome. I fell in love with that. I was actually staring at one of the aquariums and they are super beautiful. Then upon reading the label, it says, Milk fish. Bangus in Filipino. One of the fishes that I love eating. <laughs> Ocean Park reminded me of Ocean Park here in the Philippines and Enchanted Kingdom combined. Third, Hong Kong is one of the safest cities in the world. Hong Kong is one of the safest cities in the world. I remember traveling here the first time. I'd go out of my hostel alone at 10 p.m. to shop and you won't feel harassed or molested. Fourth, I love the energy, freedom, spirit. It's like always moving. I love watching people here, looking at how they dress, how they move. They're law-abiding but still feeling free. You can be whatever or whoever you want here. They take pride in their appearance and it's like there's a daily fashion parade. Fifth is food. I like eating Chinese food. You can find delicious food in any street whether it's street food or fine dining. Pro tip, if you came to HK and plan to travel with just a little budget, you can bring in food like a loaf of bread, cup noodles, or 3-in-1 coffee. Or if you don't like to bring in food, there are groceries and lots of market where you can buy cheaper than restaurants. Number 6, Shopping! Hong Kong is 
full of shops ranging from street market to high-end shopping malls. Mong Kok is a bargain shopper's paradise, although this time, I wasn't able to go there because of the weather situation. Tip! Bring your own shopping bag because they charge extra for shopping bags or plastics. Also, if you will bargain, make sure that you will definitely buy or else they will run after you. And I am dead serious. And let's proceed with what I don't like about Hong Kong. Even if you go here a lot of times, wandering aimlessly will still get you lost. Second, locals have a hard time speaking in English. They can understand even the most basic English. Sometimes it is even better to just go online and search for directions there and then just go with the signs. Third, it's congested. It's like a forest of skyscrapers. People talking loudly. Well, that's a cultural trait, but still, if you don't like crowded places, Hong Kong is not for you. Anyway, after all the pros and cons, Hong Kong is very close to my heart and I'll definitely go back.